in this question we are expected to arrange r people from n people along a circular table so it's a circular permutation however they are saying that the seating is same if each person has same neighbors no matter which side he is seated so let us consider this we have say a d z f g h and q sitting together like this according to what they are saying as long as the person has same neighbor so if i flip this instead of clockwise to anti clockwise suppose i have a and this side that's d there is z and then f and g and h and q so now a has the same neighbors d and q so here also q and d h has the same neighbors q and g q and g similarly f has g and z and f has g and z so what has happened here is this is clockwise and this is anti clockwise and they both are supposed to be considered the same so the number of circular permutations we'll get first of all if we look at it is uh, taking r out of n people so we can first arrange them as npr which will give us in a sequence like this so this is 1 2 3 so on till r now in a circular permutations you get r repetitions because it doesn't matter which person you start from so each of these can be the starting point and it will be the same circular permutation so we will get r repetitions so therefore divided by r and now since clockwise and counterclockwise doesn't matter each of these is repeated once which means you have to divide by 2 so this will be the answer for our question